Hi, first of all, thank you very much for being our valued customer. So today in this video, I am going to explain you if you have bought any theme from realgpl.com, then how to install that GPL theme. It's a very simple process, but yet some people who have just started their blogging journey or website journey, they don't know some things. And because of that, they were not able to install some particular themes. So today I am going to tell you what are the procedure which you have to follow after buying any theme from realgpl.com to install it. So for installing, we are going to use a test site, which is realgpl.com slash test. We have already installed the WordPress. So what happens when you install WordPress for the first time, you might get an interface like this, where the theme is 2021. You can also install any other theme which you want. But let's suppose I am a user like you and I have just bought rehab theme. So I'm going to open up my order as a test user. And the order is this one, which is in processing now completed. So I'm going to click on view. So the question comes is how will you install the rehab theme GPL or whatever theme which you have bought on your WordPress. So first of all, you have to download that. So I am going to download the particular theme which I want to install or which I have bought because if you are a member and if you have a joined membership, then in that case, you might have access to all themes and plugins. So, so if you want to be a member, you can check our all four membership plans that is for monthly, yearly, for three year and for lifetime also. And that is also in a very, very reasonable cost. So you can see I have downloaded my theme in the document. Okay, so this is the rehab theme which I have downloaded. So what you have to do, first of all, if you open this, because you know it's a zip file. So if you open this, you will see some files here like rehab and then under that, you can see there are two files, rehab theme and rehab child. So what people generally does, they install the whole package. That is not the right way. So first of all, if I go to my test site and if I go to the appearance and theme section, and what will happen if I upload the whole package? So I'm going to click on add new, then upload theme, then choose file, and I'm going to choose the file which we have downloaded that is rehab and then i'm going to click on open and then then i'm clicking on install now button so see what will happen because you know the file which we are installing right now is not the correct file this is the whole package of rehab theme this could be the whole package for the theme which you have bought and downloaded so the basic thing that which we have to do is after downloading first of all check the theme content so you can see here we are getting a message like the package could not install the theme is missing the style.css style set file so in that case you know first of all what you have to do just unzip the file which you have downloaded or bought so i am going to extract here you can use any tool like uh, 7zip winrar winzip to do this so you can see like we got a folder. So in this folder, if you see, we are having documentation, licensing, change log, and then child and the parent theme. So we have to install this one, not the whole package. So in the same way, many people does this mistake. So you don't have to do this. You just extract your file, you just unzip your file, and then check for the right theme zip file, either it is child or parent theme, install both and activate child. So I'm going to do that in front of you. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to my test site again, I'm going to themes. And this time I will click on add new, I will click on upload theme again, choose file. I will choose the correct file from the folder, which is this one. I will click on open and then I will click on install now. So now this theme should be properly installed and it may take around uh, some time depending on theme size and depending on the internet connection you have. So you just have to wait till the uploading finishes and the theme get installed. 
now you can see the theme is installed successfully so what we have to do we have to click on activate but as you can see right now we are also having child theme with us so if you have downloaded a theme that also contains child theme then what you have to do you have to install child theme also so i am going to theme i have not activated that i am going to theme i am going to click on add new and this time i will upload and install the child theme and then i'll click on install now button so child theme is very important and in gpl it is more important uh, that is for updation so so in the next video when i will cover how to update a theme or gpl theme then i will tell you the importance of child theme so i am going to activate the child theme not the parent theme okay so child theme should be activated not the parent theme and if the theme asks for license you have to ignore that because in gpl there is no license and now once the theme is installed and the child theme is activated it is time to install the recommended plugins so i am going to click on begin installing plugins select all and click on install and then apply once installed you have to select all again and you have to click on activate so you will be installing and activating all the required plugins so right now i am going to activate all of them at once you can see like every plugin which was required is now installed and if you go to dashboard you may see uh, the next step and that is you know uh, in this theme the welcome screen is coming in your theme it may be something else so i am going to click on start okay we'll click on there are important theme options and uh, the rehab theme has many thing so i am going to use any one in front of you like uh, recas okay and similarly you can see the uh, preview of that in the bottom okay so i'm going to use review it okay and i'm going to click on import so this will import all the theme options generally it will be installed in a minutes then you have to set logo and all so you have to do it on your own okay and if you need any support our email id is there in the bottom of the video you can always contact us through our contact and support page also you can also create a support ticket if you want uh, from your account so it's done i'm not going to change anything i'm just going to click on save 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 just to finish this process you have to do it accordingly because you are the one who need this theme i am the one who is just dem demonstrating how to install a gpl theme okay you are good to go yeah click on next that's it back to let's back to dashboard so once again let me just refresh this to see if the things are coming here in the way we wanted so you can see the theme is properly installed and the theme settings are also there only the demo is missing so in that case i will go to uh, rehab and then i will go to demo import you have to find out the respective option for your website for your theme and then i am going to choose any one like remarket and i will click on import demo okay it will take some time to import the demo so i am clicking on continue and import but before that you can see elementary plugin is active but woocommerce is not active and to install this woocommerce is required so what we have to do we have to install this plugin before uh, importing demo okay otherwise the demo could be not properly imported and you might miss some important features so you can see like woocommerce is now uh, installed and activated so let's continue our demo import process and uh, it will take some time depending on your internet connection side depending on your hosting provider depending on the resources which you have from your hosting provider so you can see here the demo import is complete and that doesn't require any license key for this team but for something it may need we'll cover that in the upcoming videos so i am going to take a look at the website now to check everything is 
working fine or not so it's, so you can see the demo is imported properly and everything looks just great so i hope uh, you got the proper idea of gpl theme installation and you will not stuck in this process but still if you have any queries you can always write us to our email and and you can always create a support ticket from the help section so thank you very much for having me or being with us and once again if you have not joined the membership you should join because in membership plans you are getting access of each and every theme and plugin and that too for a lifetime or for a certain duration in reasonable cost so i hope you will join thank you very much bye bye